every baseball fan from their old, new on site. As a rookie in 1936, Joe had come up to the Yankees from their San Francisco farm club and broken into a lineup of seasoned stars. His reputation preceded him. Everyone agreed that Joe DiMaggio was the greatest ball player to ever graduate from the Pacific Coast. And nobody was a bit surprised when DiMaggio made the transition from minor league to major league without breaking stride. Dubbed the Yankee Clipper, young Joe took over center field with the coolest authority of a veteran. From that moment on, he was the reigning king of baseball. In his first full season in a New York uniform, Jolting Joe batted 347 and whacked out the amazing total of 46 home runs to lead the league in that department. He is the only player to ever play on four pennant winning and world championship teams in his first four years in the majors. But this figured, any ball club who had Joe's bat and glove had to be tops in their league. On 13 occasions in his career, he was chosen to play on the American League's All-Star Squad. In 1941, he established a record that will probably stand a long time. Joe hit safely in 56 consecutive ball games, breaking an all-time record of 44 set by Wee Willie Keeler back in 1897. The Yankee Clipper was a magician with a 40-ounce bat.